Happy Sunshine family. Lunacy is back. We're here with an update on Wolfgang Halbig and his journey through these lawsuits pertaining to Sandy Hook. Today is October 16th, 2018. Um, I had a phone call today from Wolfgang Halbig. It was very short. Um, he wasn't feeling up to recording a talk today, so I just have a word of mouth update for you. The plaintiffs in the case uh, filed a motion for extension for a two week extension, which was granted. So uh, the hearing that he was planning on going to three weeks from the date that I interviewed him, which I believe was on the 3rd of October, uh, is, is now pushed back another two weeks. And the question still remains if this is gonna be heard in the Connecticut state courts or if it's gonna be heard in the US federal courts. Right now, the case is in the US federal courts. Uh, I got some clarification. When the lawsuit was initially filed, it was filed in the Connecticut state courts and Wolfgang got it moved over to federal courts, and now they're trying to get it moved back to Connecticut. And uh, I gave him some information. Uh, all of the Lunacy family is pretty aware that many, many institutions that purport to be government are actually corporations. Um, there's some comments in previous videos about how to go and check, check your county, check your, your courthouse, check your local treasurer. And, and you can see that in many, many instances, they are private corporations. The, they're not a government entity at all. Um, he was unaware of that. Um, he's, he really, he's got his hands full. I don't know that uh, he can come up to speed on that learning curve. And I don't know that there's really a solid destination to or a solid foundation of that information to be able to to launch a defense from at least for Wolfgang and in the way that he's handling this lawsuit um, if there's anyone in the lunacy family leave me a comment down below or send me an actually uh, send me an email lunacy l-u-n-a-s-e-e -E, at protonmail.com so Wolfgang's going to give me a buzz back when, when he knows some more information uh, about whether it's been moved back to Connecticut State Court or if it's going to stay in federal court. And I also uh, read to him some of your comments that you left in my video. Um, Mary Smith, uh, this, is a, this is a great comment. I, I want you to know that I personally read your comment over the phone to Wolfgang, and so he's going to be on the lookout. It, it was less than two hours ago that you left this comment, um, but he's, he's received that already, so he's going to be looking for something from you in the mail. Uh, let him know that there's an awful lot of support for Wolfgang and that there's a lot of concern and a lot of interest to have continued updates in this. So that's, that's about the extent of this update. It's a real short video. I just wanted to touch base with you guys. Please continue to spread the link of the interview I gave. Share that through your social media platforms. And, and let's really get a center of massive awareness around this topic. And let's all take a moment throughout our day and affirm to grace or whoever it is that you have a relationship with that is, you know, maybe you call this consciousness God, uh, set some safe space and an intention that Wolfgang Halbig's continued journey with this Sandy Hook saga unfolds in a peaceful and easy fashion. Um, and that true justice is served and that the light of truth dissolves the deception around the Sandy Hook fiasco. I love you guys a lot.
please give that video a thumbs up. I feel that the more thumbs up that that video gets, the higher it's going to appear in search engine results. It's starting to pick up traction now. Um, I've been getting about 200 views a day uh, for the past couple days, and today is on track to have even more. So let's take another effort, share that, go in, like it, give it a thumbs up if you haven't already, subscribe to this channel for continued updates, and I will be back when I have some more information on this matter. Bye-bye.